Let's learn something amazing today. Lesson 4 Your Own Book of Science. Part 2 Puzzles in Your Surroundings. Puzzles are something that make us wonder why or how did it happen. So here in this lesson, we are going to find the answers to many such puzzles. The first puzzle. We feel very hot in summer. The sun shines brightly and the temperature is high and then suddenly there are clouds in the sky and it starts raining not just water but even small balls of ice we say it has started Hailing. The small balls of ice are called hailstones. Why does it hail in the hot summer season? Let's find out. As we move up from the land, the temperature begins to fall. Up in the sky, it is very cold, even in the hot season. You know that there are water particles in the clouds that we see in the sky. Very high up in the sky, the water particles in the clouds turn into little bits of ice. Sometimes there are strong winds in the clouds. They push these little bits of ice upward so they do not fall to the ground. They go up and collect more water particles which freeze onto them. Thus, the tiny balls get bigger and bigger. They turn into hailstones. The heavy hailstones then fall to the ground in the form of a shower. Very tiny hailstones melt before they reach the ground. They turn into raindrops but some hailstones reach the ground before they melt. A light shower of hail can be great fun but a hailstorm, but a hailstorm can cause great damage to vehicles. You can see in the picture how the vehicles are damaged because of the hailstones. Even plants are destroyed. Crops in the fields are damaged. Even birds and animals lose their life. Maharashtra was hit by a series of hailstorms in the year 2014. Because of this hailstorm, the fruit crops were destroyed. The crops were damaged and the farmers 
suffered heavy losses even birds and animals were killed and injured in large numbers it was a great natural calamity let's move further and try to get answers to some more interesting puzzles we all love flowers they come in different colors Did you enjoy watching this flowers? But have you ever wonder where do flowers get get their color from? The flowers get their color from the color pigments present in that flower. children what you can see now trees grass leaves they all are the part of nature have you ever thought why are leaves green The leaves are green because of chlorophylls present in them. Yes, because of chlorophylls the leaves are green in color. Are you excited to find some more answers? Let's continue. We all have seen this in our homes. We have it in our homes. Right. It's an onion. Children, have you ever experienced what happens when someone cuts an onion? Yes. it makes us cry but do we really cry makes you wonder why why does chopping an onion make you cry when we cut an onion certain chemicals are released in the form of vapor which react with the water in our eyes due to this chemical reaction tears flow from our eyes let's now begin with the written work of the lesson kindly take a fresh page in your notebook note write each question on a separate page and draw suitable pictures the name of the lesson lesson 4 your own book of signs question 1 where do flowers get their color from
आंसर द फ्लावर्स गेट द कलर फ्रॉम द कलर पिगमेंट्स प्रेजेंट इन दैट फ्लावर Now children you are going to write only this question and answer in one page and below this answer you are going to draw your favorite flower and color it Question two: Why are leaves green? Answer: The leaves are green because of chlorophylls present in them. Now, this question you are going to take another new page. write the question the answer and you will draw any leaf and color it question 3 why does chopping an onion make you cry answer when we cut an onion certain chemicals are released in form of vapor which react with the water in our eyes due to this chemical reaction tears flow from eyes again you are going to take the third page write this question the answer and below this you are going to draw and color some onions Thank you. Have a nice day.